Hey, Sue. Whew. The day is over, thankfully. I spent my birthday at the workhouse, which was fine. We had a, actually a pretty good day. It was pretty slow and going. But Sister Dorothy just had to throw a kink in things. That's just like something Sister Dorothy would do. So Sister Dorothy was working back there in prep. And uh, she decided, of all days on my birthday, that she wanted to clean the fryer out. Sister Dorothy ain't never cleaned no fryer out. But she said that grease need changing. And she wanted to get it changed. I said, okay, Sister Dorothy, then go ahead and do it. She said, but I don't know how. I said, of all the days of the year, you want me to show you, really, you want me to do it. You want me to change this grease on my birthday? Look at my shirt. It's pretty. I don't want to get dirty on my birthday, Sister Dorothy. Sister Dorothy didn't care for them. Did not care one bit. So I helped Sister Dorothy. And, you know, a lot of times people like to play like they don't know what they're doing. And she's like, what now? What now? Sugar, I showed her. I taught her because, you know, they say knowledge is power and I want her to be a powerful young lady. And so um, I taught her how to do it and I let her do it pretty much hands on hands. She said, what I do next? I said, you take this and do this and you do that. And I made her do it. I said, you ain't finna ruin my birthday changing some grease. They could have did that tomorrow. But anyway, Sister Dorothy did it. And then Perlene, I scared the crap out of Perlene. Perlene was back there and uh, I come around the corner and she jumped. Sure. She was getting her little bite to eat. I said, Perlene, you the worst little stealer or thief I've ever seen in my life. She said, Sugar, I was going to ask you. I said, I know you was, Perlene, but she jumped like she wasn't going to ask me. But she always asked me, but she jumped real quick. So I'm, I don't I don't know what she was going to do. But anyway, so the day is over. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. We're going to Pensacola Beach or Pensacola. I don't know if we're going to go to the beach. It's too doggone hot to go to the beach. If we go to the beach, we're just going to have a couple cocktails. Um, Cause I'm not sitting out on no beach sweating. I'm not gonna do it. I can sit at home and sweat. But we're gonna go down to Pensacola this weekend. I think we're gonna leave Friday instead of tomorrow. We'll probably end up leaving tomorrow. Cause I always do this. Eric's like, do you want to get a room for Thursday night, Friday night, and Saturday night? And I was like, no, let's just save money and just go Friday night. And then when the day before comes, I'll be like, well, we ain't got nothing to do. Let's go ahead and go. So we'll probably um, end up going tomorrow night or he might try to make a point and not go because i said no let's be cheap but anyway we got us a cute little room i ain't never seen this hotel before and i don't know the name but it looked like a little old um hotel it's got this little old cute little vintage little room and stuff i think i think so maybe vintage ain't the word but anyway it's cute i ain't never been at that hotel or whatever so i think it's gonna be fun anyway sugar i'll quit boring y'all and all that good stuff bye bye now